Hello guys, hello guys, hello guys, and welcome to something I've been looking very much forward to unboxing my goodies here in Fortnite completed the tutorial now I have my loot tutorial and after that I will be getting the goodies that I have been Well that I paid for more or less so I'm looking very much forward to that all right first loot llama here not really that exciting but I'm not really expecting this to be the exciting thing <laughs> no I am not an upgrade llama the loot concept in Fortnite, if you're unfamiliar with it, is that you have two types of loot. You have the llama loot and you have some chest loot. The llama loot is where you get your you get uh, recipes, recipes, you get heroes, defenders, all sorts of things that you really need, like core parts in the game that you can use account-wise moving forward. Then you have some, some loot chests after completing missions and these loot chests can scale from like chest 1 to chest 6 and they have a given amount of resources or uh, timed event specific things related to the map that you're playing in. So there are like these two different things. The most important thing right now though is this here, the Believer Gift. I'm looking forward to that because this is like a super gift that is given to early bird players that has 15 of these loot llamas in it and I'm really excited about checking this stuff out here founders coins another early bird kind of thing it's a currency only usable at the startup part of the game that allows us to buy a loot llama really <laughs> founders loot llama all right rare stuff so what, what are we looking at here what are all the goodies that we're unboxing I've been reading quite a bit about the game and it is much more complex than what it really looks like, but uh, first things first, I'm hoping to see a legendary or mythic survivor. Survivors are the key in Fortnite based on everything I've been able to nudge out towards, read about, look into. Ooh, silver! Oh yeah, these llamas, both the, the mini ones and the upgrade ones, can become silver when you hit them and there is a tiny chance that they will also turn golden when you hit them again giving you a legendary guarantee so that would be really nice to see as well but regardless survivors are like the key to making it <laughs> in in Fortnite of course you have your hero your hero is like the character you play but you have survivors that you need to put into squads that actually boost your entire account level meaning that no matter what hero you choose to play it will have these survivor related boosts so of course I'm hoping to see some really cool survivors that I can like nudge my experience points into evolve all that kind of stuff so that I have something stable to focus on instead of replacing all of my my stuff all the time because I know I'm gonna be getting a legendary hero because I, I bought the super deluxe premium crazy kind of pack so I'm covered in terms of hero I'm covered in terms of weapon schematic for my hero so that's all good times really so like the next piece of the puzzle that would be really amazing would be to see some crazy survivors but yeah we'll see we have loads of stuff coming loads of unboxings gonna be happening I'm gonna be having like daily loot llamas also because I am a founder and because I bought the super deluxe premium crazy kind of silly pants package so loads of stuff gonna be <laughs> open so I'm sure I'm gonna be getting one at some point but for now this is just the believer pack this is not even my my founder's goodies, I'm not even into the, like, you bought the big package kind of stuff. This is a Believer pack. Ooh, another silver. Go Golden! Come on, Goldie Pants, you know you can do it. Come, no. All right, all right, all right. Well, silver is good as well. It's better than not silver. So, what do we have here? Anyway, loads of different things in here, and of course, everything I know about the game at this point here is based on me reading about it, so... It's not really first hand kind of information yet, but hopefully I'm going to have experienced things as well. But from what I have like nudged out of the game information, a huge part of Fortnite is retiring survivors and heroes and defenders and schematics so that you can boost the experience you get for doing that into the ones you actually want to use. You're gonna have like a broad palette of different things you can do but you can choose to sacrifice to say a lot of it in order to boost up specific ones and I'm a bit of a grinder kind of guy so I will probably be stashing up one of each instead of just mass sacking it all but 
I, I don't know, I don't know how, how hungry I'm gonna be once I start playing, where <laughs> I guess only time will tell. I'm getting loads of these Founders Coins, which is a good thing, I guess. Unless, of course, it's just counting up. Yeah, it's probably just counting up. I'm pro I think I only got 10, and then it went from 120. <laughs> this is cool! 120 to 130. Come on, go golden! No! Ah, uh, how dare ya. How rude. So I'm getting loads of stuff, and I haven't seen any legendaries, I haven't seen any mythics, I've seen loads of different schematics for weapons, I've seen a few different characters of different types, so it's a, it's a very nice getting started kind of package, and everybody gets this, also players that don't have the super deluxe kind of crazy thing, so this is a huge getting started boost for new players, I can imagine anyway, because if you're gonna be starting out later and you don't get this, Whoa, you're losing out on epics and stuff. So, wow, this is this is a very nice extra thing they're giving us. I'm pretty hyped about them. Die all right already with the, with the rule of sword. I like that. There are so many fun things I have spotted already in Fortnite. I am beyond amazed with this game. I'm looking so much forward to digging more into it. And of course, by the time this stuff here hits YouTube, I've probably been pay playing like a week or two or something like that. But I'm gonna be catching up with my game progression pretty pretty fast, I think. I'm gonna be sharing every titty bit and game time I have, just highlights, and then hopefully at some point it's gonna be a streaming thing, but yeah, so many plans, so many dreams, so many awesomeness, really, <laughs> ready to get fired up. So here we have the launch event llama that requires these founders coins, let's check it out. So it looks more potty -ish. let's hope it's better. I mean, it should be better, it's uh, like early bird, super rare currency, kind of give me legendaries and mythics, is what I'm saying, really. Come on, rare survivor, rare, 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 rare. Uh, given that I've put in, in so much into the game, I, I have this feeling that I don't give a rats about rare, I want epic legendaries and <laughs> mythics, so I don't want the other stuff, even though it may be super cool, fun and amazing, I, I'm expecting to be playing at a higher tier from the start, giving all the bucks I've been sending there away, but uh, we'll find out. So that was what we had in that one, so not bad, not bad, definitely an epic pack. Anything else I can do now, I can buy these upgrade llama for my, for V-Coins, uh, no V-Bucks, I need V-Bucks. And I can buy that stuff. All right, let's go in here. All right, quest complete. Loot llamas, we opened them. Yes, we did. And this here is actually... Well, I was looking very much forward to the Believer pack, but this here is where I'm getting my goodies. This is the congratulations, you paid your money. <laughs> You're gonna get this stuff. And this is, of course, what I've been looking forward to. Standard edition rewards. Everybody gets this to buy the game. Seven days of founder's rewards and some home base banner designs and it's important to note these seven days means one per day for seven days it's not seven per day so yeah deluxe edition rewards i also have that oh yeah but i topped it besides that but let's let's grab this something special let's check it out and what do we have here we have five upgrade llama tokens so those are llamas i can like unbox whenever i want Experience boost, teammates experience boost, armory slots, and some rare heroes, which is nice to have so that I can toy around with them and find out if I possibly want to buy the even larger version of the game where I can get them all uh, in, in Legendary, which I'm probably going to do, but we'll see. And we have some starting weapons, Founders Daily rewards 21 additional days of one per day, which is nice, home, ba home base banners, which is kind of cool, and more weapons. Weapons in the game, they break when you use them, so having a lot of weapons starting up is really <laughs> completely junk, but of course you need them to play the character. What you really need is schematics so that you can craft them, so I hope I'm going to be getting that as well. Alright, more experience boost, and teammate boost, and armor slots, and party experience buff. Oh, that's kind of cool. So, and 14 additional days, and of course the founder's friends codes. Nice, because I do have quite a decent sized family. And there we have them, epic and epic defenders. I'm probably going to keep them just because, even though I should sack them for all I've read. Alright, another 10 llama tokens and experience ex backpack space, <laughs> nice. Armor slot, not sure what that is. Founders daily rewards, 42 additional days, another friend's code and banner, 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 banner stuff. 
All right, so loads of things in these uh, quest things. Founders Hero Bundle, yes please. So this is where I can select the legendary team of heroes that I'm going to be playing. And of course I'm going to be selecting the ninja because it's a ninja. Based on everything I've said, re read and you know, nudged out from the game, the constructor is the class to play in the game. A lot of like greedy solo players in in the Outlander. This is based on what I've read, guys. Not judging anyone yet. Uh, Constructor the strongest. Outlander like farming <laughs> ninja and soldiers probably like the most action-packed classes. And when there is a female ninja, that's what I'm gonna be grabbing. So uh, the only bad thing I can say about Fortnite so far is that the only mythic ninja there is is male, so shame on you game developers for forcing me to spend more money on the game later when you put in a sexy female ninja mythic, but besides that everything is freaking awesome so far. <laughs> Alright, so let's grab them there, we have Assassin Sarah and Bobby's girlfriend. No, boyfriend! I mean, she could be Bobby's girlfriend, but he's definitely, yeah, you know what I mean. And, oh, that's awesome, we get, we get the schematic to craft this weapon ourselves, so that is really, really, really great. Alright, so skills is another thing we have blinking here, should I? No, let's... Should I go in here and just check out that I have my hero? So many things I need to be doing, and yeah, let's just check out what we have here. Alright, the skill tree, crazy thing in the game as well, of course we're gonna be talking about that, but not in this video, this is more like an <laughs> unboxing video. Uh, but we we have some uh, some quest completion for going in here, setting things up, but the like the skill tree in this game is pretty crazy, and so is the research tree, definitely something I'm gonna be putting some time into, because Whoa, crazy pants. If you do play Fortnite and do go in every day and get your research point from everything that I've been able to read again, I think I said that like four times in this video, getting your daily research points is like so important because that is the real time sink in the game. So if you don't, you don't get your account power enough if you don't actually do your research and you get that on an hourly basis so it, and you can stash up like 20-24 hours of research or something like that so that is definitely another thing worth noting alright guys I think that was pretty much what I had in mind this video grabbing my premium deluxe super crazy <laughs> goody thingies and of course my believer pack gonna be checking out my loot llamas and stuff like that around the corner but I need to be doing some gaming now so so yeah I'm definitely gonna be, uh, be back after I've been the toy a little bit around with my new ninja Sarah. As always guys, thank you very much for watching. Contact your 24 hour tech support agent. I'd call this an emergency. Alright, I found the location. Let's get going.